let us understand the construction of epicycloid. Draw locus of a point P on the periphery of a circle, which rolls on a curved path. Take diameter of rolling circle as 50 mm and radius of directing circle as 75 mm. When the smaller circle will roll on larger circle, for one revolution, it will cover pi d distance on arc and it will be decided by included arc angle theta. Calculate theta by formula. Theta equals radius of rolling circle by radius of directing circle into 360. On calculating, we get the value of theta as 120 degree. Step 1. Draw line OPC such that OP equals 75 mm and PC equals 25 mm. Step 2. Take C as center. Draw a circle of radius 25 mm. Step 3. Through point P, draw an arc. Now mark point Q such that angle POQ equals 120 degree. Step 4. Draw an arc through point C. This line is called locus of center C. Step 5. Now divide the circle into 12 equal parts and also arc PQ in 12 equal parts. Name the given points as shown. Step 6. Extend line O1 dash till it meets locus line at C1. Similarly, extend O2 dash, O3 dash, O4 dash till O12 dash till it meets locus line at C2, C3, C4 till C12. Step 7. From points 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 on the circle, draw arc through each point specified. Step 8. Taking C1 as the center and radius equal to 25 mm, draw an arc cutting the arc through 1. Now taking center as C2, draw an arc through 2. Now taking center as C3, draw an arc through 3. Similarly, mark points from center C4, C5, C6, etc. Step 9. From the given points, draw a smooth curve. This is the required epicycloid's curve. 